So okay. for, in the first step, we've got you registered with Chef. Our next step mm -hmm. is going to be to connect your local workstation with okay. the hosted Chef. Yes. So let's go back to your terminal for a moment. Mm -hmm. And I wonder, Patrick, have you installed Chef? I think yes. Okay, you should be able to do, uh, Chef won't tell you, but you can do a Chef client. Dash V or dash dash version, mm -hmm. or just try to run it. It looks okay, like it's, it looks like it's loading. installed, yes? Yeah. <clears throat> okay, you can go ahead and cancel that. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Great. So I'll it looks go like into the working directory, yeah. Yes. Okay, so it looks like you have Chef 16.2, uh, sorry, 10.16.2 installed, which is our current uh, latest release, so that's good. I think as we go through this uh, intro to Chef, we should probably be working in a GitHub repository. So do you mind creating a new uh, Git repository? Okay, no. So... Um, it, will it be contain the cookbooks or? Um, yes. So okay. um, this is going to contain a number of things, and in fact, uh, what might make sense uh, is uh, so this is going to contain a, a full chef repo. It will include cookbooks and, mm -hmm. and a bunch of other things. Um, you might just want to go to. Uh, let me give you a URL. It's GitHub.com/opscode/slash chef dash repo ah, okay let's go there okay so this github repository is a, a basic framework that you can use to start your chef repo so you okay. can either go ahead and clone this or just download mm -hmm. uh, the files yeah. from this your choice okay Okay. Yeah, I have it. Yeah. Right. Uh, and since you did a clone there, that pulled down a dot git. You may as well uh, remove the um, the dot git directory. Mm -hmm. And that way, you're no longer yeah. connected anywhere. <clears throat> yes, indeed. Yep. Get in it. Yeah. And I will also sign up here. Um, yeah, I will. Shall I do the fork or um, I from think you, the? I think you can uh, just start a new repository in okay, your on my account. Yeah. I mm -hmm. think that would yeah. be sufficient for us here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's see. Great. Um, great new repository. I need to be on a dashboard. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Gosh. Yeah. Um, cookbook demo or ops code um, uh, demo or yeah, maybe uh, either Chef repo or Learning Chef. Maybe something. Okay, like Learning that. Chef. Yeah. Learning mm -hmm. Chef might be good. Yeah. Okay, great. Now we have it created, and you get remote at uh, origin. Ah, because I didn't have checked anything. Okay, let's try to push um, my first setup to the learning chef. Okay. Hello, Nathan? Yes, that's great. Okay, okay, so. okay, the connection is working. And we had our um, commit. Okay, great. Excellent. So we've got our first uh, commit. Now, there's nothing really exciting here other than it's set up our chef, uh, basically our chef repository for us. Uh, we won't yet do a tour through the basic uh, hierarchy here, the folder structure, but we will get to that as we come to each bit in turn.